Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to a different rebuild. We are going to go ahead and do a 10 minute Luton Town rebuild. They currently sit in 19th. And not 19th, they actually sit in 18th in the league. They are struggling massively. And obviously with the likes of Everton getting their reduction from 10 points to 6. That has put them out of the relegation race. And put Luton straight down in the middle. And looking like the front three are going to go into... Or the three that came up last season are going to go straight back down. So we are going to have 10 minutes to rebuild this team and to survive relegation. That is the only goal. Is to survive relegation with this team. And honestly just looking at it just real quick before we get anywhere I think we need a right winger I think we need another center midfield to go along with Lakonga and I think the back line definitely needs help as well so we are going to go ahead and try and do that with 10 minutes and how much money do we have to spend we have 31 million to spend how do we have 31 million I don't know but let's go ahead and start the timer in three two one go we have 10 minutes to go and to sign as much players as we can we only have 31 million to do so and i don't know who i want to sign the first signing we are trying to make is to bring in youngster George Hotto. They want Ross Barkley plus 2.2 million. Honestly, Ross Barkley can get out of here, so we will accept that happily. And we will look to bring in Hotto right away. We have 10 minutes left to do this. We still have 9 minutes left to go. That timer is very big. Let me go ahead and waste my time just slightly a little bit more. Can I hit ult on this, actually? That's about as small as I can make it without it being way too small for your eyes. So, yep, that's that. Wasted a good 20, 30 seconds there. That is perfect timing there. Let's go and get to this thing. Let's go ahead and bring this guy in. He's on 500 a week. So, 10K, he will happily take that. That's a 9,500 increase. And he will come to the team. That's our first signing done. Leave a like and subscribe if you want to see more of these 10-minute rebuilds. But Ross Barkley plus 2.2 million for Joro Hato. Instant, instant improvement there. A youngster added to the team. We are looking to bring in another center back in in Tosin. We look to bring him into the team. He could be a nice improvement for that back line alongside Hado. We are going to just add him to a five-year deal. We don't really care how much we really pay for him. As long as the wages stay down slightly because that would give us a little bit more money to flexibly with. So that is going to be that. That is signing number two done. That is two center backs done. And we have six minutes left to go. And we have around 20-ish minutes left to spend. So it's not too much. So honestly, it's only like two positions that we can really improve. Next player we're trying to bring in, trying to fill in that left wing role. And by bringing in Kevin Shade in, it might allow us to have some more flexibility and some pace down the fling there. We are going to put him on a crucial squad role, a three and a half million deal, by the way. So very cheap for him. And he will come in from a struggling Brentford side in real life as well. Into a very struggling Luton Town side in real life in the hopes of, again, trying to survive relegation. That is it. We're not trying to win the league. We're not trying to win Champions League. It's just a 10-minute rebuild to try and see if we can do better than what they have done so far this year. Now, this might go badly, but everything due to simulations, we need we need a high-rated goalkeeper. So, 36-year-old Mr. In fact, I, I'm, I feel like I can get it for 500K. 36-year-old. I feel like I wasted my time here. Okay, never mind. Can't bring him in. Never mind. I was going to try and bring a high-rated goalkeeper in. That is, could have been cheap. I'm still going to go ahead and try real quick as well. Let me just see what I can do. Let's put him up to like 32 and see what happens. See any old man that's like 78 or 80 overall. Quickly, I have two and a half minutes left to go. 78, 82. Who's this? Boonu. I can't bring him in for sure. He's, way, he's over way too much. It had to be at least somewhat decent. In the market value as well. 79. How old are you? You're 35. Realistically, I kind of want like a 33-year-old. 82 for Galeski. Can I bring him in? He's still playing football. Do I have 9 million to spend? If I do this, I can't bring in a midfielder. I do have enough to get it done. Do I have a second goalkeeper that I could just go ahead and offer? A second goalkeeper in Tim Krul. Oh, Tim Krul plus what? 8 mil? 8.5 mil? What would that leave me with? Six million to bring in a midfielder if I even have time. Nine million. I have to. I have to just go eight five. I'll add on selling clause. Hopefully they accept that selling clause. They do. Okay, perfect. 
Okay, perfect. We're gonna have to go ahead and negotiate this quickly. I might have to just bring in a random CM. Crucial. Yes, come on. I need you in quickly. I need you in now. Five years. Oh, you're not gonna want five years. You're gonna want one year. That's honestly fine. Go. I got a minute and a half. Time goes by fast. Especially goes by fast when you're trying to decide what to do. You can have 60k. I don't care. That'll leave me with two and a half million. That might leave me in with the loan, honestly. That might just leave me with the loan. And I think I know exactly who I want to loan in. Possibly. If it go quickly, come on. Go quickly. Go quickly. Go quickly. Who can I loan in? Who can I loan in? Who can I loan in? I want somebody stupid. Can I loan in somebody stupid? A center mid from England. Oh shit. Center mid from England. The Premier League. I got 44 seconds left. I'm gonna have to be able to buy them. I'm gonna have to be able to buy them. You. I don't know if I can buy you. Approach alone now. Am I gonna be able to get it done in 30 seconds? I'm not gonna be able to sim quick enough in 30 seconds. Basic terms. One year. Come on, yes. I'll accept the wages. That's fine. I'll accept the wages. It's done. I just got to get him to accept it. Just get him to accept it. Sim a couple days. Please, Don't nothing else. No, I don't need this. I don't need this. Oh, wait. This is him coming in. This is him coming in. Come on. We got it done. And with literally 10 seconds left to go, it's done. That's the last signing we will make. And that is that. <sighs> the signings have been made. Let's go and give a recap of the signings that we have made. To go ahead and hopefully survive relegation. We bring in, not Casper Schmeichel, but we bring in Hado. We bring in Tosin. We bring in Kevin Shade. We bring in Puto Golaski, who might backfire immensely for eight and a half million that was spent. And then we bring in Belagarde, who might not be too good. Let's go and put him in the team and see how it looks. So we have Belagarde, then we have Goloski, and that is the changes there. Goloski, we have Tosin, we have Hado there, we have Dodori, we have Shade, Belagarde. This is your starting 11 to take on the Premier League and hopefully, hopefully survive relegation. Let's go and simulate to around the beginning of March just to see where they're at, and then we'll sim the end of the season as well. Let me save it before it crashes. And... <laughs> Pretty much the same exact point that they're at in real life. We are not doing better than what they're doing in real life. And in fact, we actually have more points than them. But after 26 games, we sit in the same exact spot in 24 in, in 18th. This time with 24 points instead of the 20 that they have in real life. Burnley are doing better in all th in all plans. Burnley are doing better. We're not completely in. We're not like drawn completely out. And we're not like completely relegated. We are still fighting. We are still only three points off of 14th place Wolves. In fact, we have actually have a game in hand. So if we were to win a game in hand, let's just say when is that game in hand? Who knows? This, oh, the game in hand is probably Liverpool, isn't it? All right, well, we'll see at the end of the season whether or not the boys can survive. I sure as heck hope so. I'm starting to believe not so. And after 38 games, the boys finish in 17th. So we do technically do better than them in real life. Maybe not too much better. We survived relegation by 5 points. So, I mean, there is that. So we go ahead and survive relegation. So I guess technically the challenge is completed. It's completed, I should say. Chef United and Burnley both go down like they are going to go down in real life. And Luton Town survive relegation like they probably won't in real life. Just for fun, who won the title? It's City. I thought I thought it was Spurs for a second. It's City who won the league title. That's gonna be the end of this video. Let's go and check out the squad though. Shade 73, Hado 74. That is the end of this game. Of this end of the video. If you did enjoy it, go ahead and leave a like and subscribe. If you want to see more, drop a comment what team you want me to rebuild next. Peace out.